Highlighting the top 10 invasive species, that is what state agencies and private partners working to rid Hawaii of these damaging species are doing in a couple of hours. KITV4's Ashley Moser joining us live from the state capitol with more on this. Good morning, Ash. Hey, good morning, and Hawaii's isolation has made our island state home to more invasive species than anywhere in the U.S. Joining me now with more information, we have Christy Martin with Sea Gaps. Good morning to you. Good morning. So your organization works a lot to bring to light uh, the different invasive species. Can we even put a number on how many there are here in our state? I think that would be really difficult because, of course, the definition is just a little bit blurred. So, uh, but one study back in 1985 uh, documented that there's probably about 200 plants uh, that are damaging watershed forests, and, and that was back then, so I'm sure we have plenty more now. And those are just plants, and you just came out with the top 10, there are so many, but the top 10 worst offenders here in Hawaii. For me, at least, I was surprised to see rats and mongoose on that list. It's, it's difficult to choose a top 10, rats and mongoose on the list. I think one reason that rats in particular are on the list is that they, they are everywhere. They're around our buildings, around our homes, but they're also very plentiful in the forest, and they're doing their impacts there. They're eating seeds, they're eating bird eggs, uh, young birds. It's having a huge ecosystem impact. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And this morning here at the Rotunda, you'll be having a press conference uh, to thank a lot of people who have been fighting this. I think people can get a little bit depressed about the influx and, and spread of invasive species. Really what uh, Hawaii Invasive Species Awareness Week is about is celebrating those people and those groups that really put forth the effort to address this problem. Thank you so much, Chris. I appreciate that. So again, the press conference starting right here at the Rotunda at 8.30 this morning. Reporting live, Ashley Moser, KITV4 News. Back to you.